Hey guys, this is Fizz, the brewery management game. Okay, I just bought this off the Play Store for $2.99. It looked pretty interesting. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and play it. New game. Uh, okay, let's do this. Ooh! What should I name it? What should I name it? I do not know. Ooh, let's see. Number one. Uh, I'm looking around my room to see anything. Bruco, that's an example, so. Oh my gosh, I do not know what to name my brewery. The Eagle Co. There we go. I don't know if I want to call it that. I do not know if I want to call it that. Um. Let's see. Oh my gosh, my cat keeps on bothering me. Okay, 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 okay. The Eagle Company. I hope we can change it later. Oh wait, wait, I have an idea. The drunkards. Nah. The. Oh, I got one. The drunk almond. The drunk almond. The drunk almond company. There we go. That's a little bit of an inside joke for me and one other dude. Okay. <laughs> Greetings. My name is Cyrus Uprum. I am well known in this area as a brewer and host of notable brewing events. I also help out the new brewers such as yourself, but we'll get more acquainted later. For now, it's time to get started in your own brewery. First, choose your character, then we go over the basics. Have fun! Okay. Let's see them characters. Kip Douglas. After years of hearing from your friends how tasty your home brew is, you've decidedly, you finally decided to quit your day job and brew full time. He's balanced and everything for a starter oh okay huh okay so they're all level ones that's cool oh I wish you could like change the name of our people I kind of like this dude right here, he looks chill. Not as much as this dude, he's like weird. Ugh. Okay, but I'm gonna be Marcus Helmsley with a special ability of plus one quality to all batches brewed. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the garage. Let's get down to business and brew beer. Okay, tap this button. This menu is where you gain access to everything in the game. Now tap the brew button. Here you can view a list of all recipes available to you. Ooh. So I press view. 
Recipes are, are made by arranging specific ingredients in specific patterns. You can place ingredients one by one from the ingredients tab or fill them all at once. So I can just fill. Oh. If you don't all if you don't own all the ingredients, this screen allows you to buy them all at once. Okay, bought. Now that the recipe is prepared, you can proceed. I have no idea what this is. Oh, I can't click on the ingredients. Okay. Jobs. On this page, you can assign each of your employees one of the four brewing jobs. Here are the shown up shown at the bottom left. The selected job, cleaning, has a flashing yellow background. Employee attributes attributes are shown above with the required attributes for the highlighted job highlighted in yellow. The cleaning job requires patience. Choosing the employee with the highest attributes for each job improves your brew. Okay. All right. And then job assignment to assign job you just drag job. Well done. I do that with the remaining employees. Boom. Fermenting. Oh, okay. Thanks. Okay. Uh, okay, and then packaging. Just, oh, yeah. Now all jobs are assigned, proceed, press next. Review. This screen allows you to review the batch you're about to brew and to spend your team's craft points. Ooh. Craft points are contributed by each employee's craft attribute and improve your batch in various ways. You can allocate them differently each time you brew. Okay. Spend points. This time, let's spend them on an increased yield, which boosts the number of beers made at this point, at this batch. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, now I can start brewing. Oh, but what about the other stuff? Come on. Okay. Now watch as your team brews this batch of beer. Floating numbers show when an employee adds quality points to the batch. They help your beer sell better in markets and perform better at competitions. All right. Ooh, I see you. Hot, hot, hot. What is she doing? What? Oh, 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 oh. The Drunk Almond Company. Oh yeah, or Incorporated. They're doing something, I don't know what. Oh yeah, plus 10 quality. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. New record, quality of 300. Okay, batch complete. Once a batch is completed, your employees are awarded XP and you can sell the batch or save it for later. Let's send this batch straight to the market. Oh yeah. You can choose where you sell your beer. Uh, some info is public knowledge, while must be some must be researched. Okay. Oh, look at that. 60 com customers per month with a stock fee of 200. Self shelf space available. Zero commission is six at this market to zero. Total profit zero. Okay. Hmm. Do research. Okay. Market research. Research can help you determine what types of beer will sell well and how you should price your beer. You select your what information to discover with what research and how fast. Okay. The instant option. For now, we'll leave the other options default and learn about the cust market's customers. Oh my gosh. Sorry, guys. Research. Oh my gosh, so much woods. When, when shopping, customers compare your beer to others in the market. They judge each beer based on mix of quality points, price markup, and their favorite 
styles and flavors of beer than buy the one they think is the best. Now I press sell. In terms of sale, you choose out how much this, your beer to sell and at what price. Market research can help with the decisions. This time we'll sell it priced so everyone can afford to buy some. Oh, you can't change it. Okay, fine. Begin sale. The batch is now available to buy until stock sells out or expires from being on the shelf too long. Although you won't see them, customers continually, continuously shop at markets while the game is unpaused. Press X to exit. Huh. Can, I, can I press sell feedback? Brew info? Okay. Oh, look at that money. At least profits are going up, so we don't lose any money. Sold by Eddie's Bodega. Price is 10 monies. Sales span three quarters of a month. Okay, let's press X. End of tutorial. Use profit gain from the sales to improve your brewery with new employees, recipes, equipment, and marketplaces. When unsure what to do next, try checking menu to challenges. Okay. Okay, one more thing. Can we enable analytics? And then an analytics systems issues report like error number 57. What happened to the user in New York, New York? Uh, sure. Woot. Oh, yeah. 1,000. Oh, no. Also, if you change your mind later, you can always disable analytics via the options menu. Oh, my gosh. Yes. I'm always happy to help out. Okay. Yeah. Recommended earn 1,250 points all. Earn a 500 quality batch. Recommend get a upgraded piece of equipment. New employees available. New marketplaces. Oh yes. Recipes. Yes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Profit of 55 bucks. I mean coins. Uh, okay, that would be it for the first one. So, see you guys and have a great day. This is then that is all for the Drunk Almond Company or Incorporated. But yep, see ya.